Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. Time to start the Goron Temple. You can tell me what to do. Okay, you were giving me advice. I'm sorry for doubting you. <laughs> so yeah, that oh, I didn't how did I touch the spikes at that angle? Ah, oh, whatever. But uh yeah, don't touch the quicksand. You cannot go through the quicksand at all. Oh jeez bemos. Um, 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 boop. Bemos are one difficult to avoid inv invincible enemy around these parts. Because, uh, yeah, you got these. Oh, shoot. This is going in the direction that I'm going. Um, okay, run, 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 run. Hit the switch. But, yeah. When you leave, leave the switch. Oh, shoot. I didn't mean to, <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. When you leave. The switch the spikes pop right back out so we gotta oops we gotta go push and pull this thing through the beamos which are not friendly in the oh in the slightest but i managed to escape unscathed somehow that's oh no you don't <laughs> blue shoes i will not deal with you um we gotta shoot that eye from right up here but beware beware the armos yeah, you just hit him with a bomb and you're good. <laughs> and, and, and. Oh, I'm gonna push, not pull. Pushing is faster than pulling, so. Yeah. And, and, and. So, pushing that on there will open up that door that we've seen when we passed through here. Well, maybe you've seen it. <laughs> It, le it didn't really look like much of a door. It looks like more of a gate than anything, but yeah, see, it's... Yeah, but well, anyway, whatever. Uh, uh oh Uh-oh. 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 Aha! Oh, I, I took a hit from my own shot. Dang it. Alright, uh, well, I got you in good position, though. And maybe I should have been pushing and not pulling. Well, whatever. I'm gonna hit the switch and it's gonna make a bridge plop out over there, but I'm still... Oh, oh, oh! I still want to pull this, though. I still need to pull this, though, actually. Yeah, there we go. Okay, shovel, obviously, because there's this. And we're going up. Now, um, this is going to be like a little timing-based puzzle type thing. What we got to do is uh, plop that down. Oh, shoot, that might have been not what I wanted to do. Cause it go okay, because <laughs> it goes away pretty quick. Yeah, hitting that switch on the sand over there, that's why I didn't do it from the other side. Because, yeah, I can get the treasure map easier from up here. In fact, this is pretty much the only way to get it. Because, yeah, it takes too long to go around there. And you gotta just throw something at it from up here. Now, uh, get your bombs out. Because we're gonna need them. Oh! I'm doing this at point blank range. And I should not be doing that. Oh, jeez! <laughs> oh, whatever. We're okay. We'll be able to recover our health nicely. Um... Wait, can I actually shoot that eye from over here? That would be kind of interesting if I can do that. Just out of curiosity. Uh, uh, I just want to see for kicks. Because this, this just looks possible. That would be interesting to do. Uh, no, I think it won't work because it's off screen. No, nope, yep. It's off screen. It won't work. Okay. So you absolutely have to shoot it from this specific point. Boop. <clears throat> there we go. <laughs> And this opens up to reveal a red rupee! And this switch opens up a shortcut! Yeah, those spikes that I ran into a few times. <laughs> well, okay, just one time, but anyway, time to get the bombs out. Uh, oh shoot, oh shoot, oh shoot, oh shoot. Not ready to get the bombs out. <laughs> uh, hey, how's it going? How many chests are left on this floor? Uh, no treasure chests. Good! That's what I thought. Now, there's a bombable wall right here, too, but you can't see it. However, uh, this right here will hint at where that bombable wall is, based on the pillar's positions. See that? Space of pillar, and there's that piece of land that you can see over there. That is your hint that there is something right over here. Isn't that nice? <laughs> and voila! And thus we can move forward. <laughs> wah, wah! Hmm, I think there's something coming here. Uh, no, there's not. I thought there was going to be a blue chew. Maybe I was thinking of something else here. Oh, crap, it's a trap. Uh, what do we have here? Oh, yeah. Stay out of the way of the Beemos and just let them bounce around the room and just wait for them to come to you. Uh, because, yeah, the Beemos, they play a pretty, pretty big factor in fights like that. Because you have to stand still in order to use your bow or something, and, uh, 
red bubbles are hanging around there. Oh shoot. Oh shoot, okay. Run 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 ah good. <laughs> you can take a look in that corner too, I guess, if you want to, but it's not really anything special there. It's just a, a square battle arena with quicksand in the middle, and they're on the sides. Boop. Uh are you gonna tell me about the chests? Yeah, the merch is the two. I think I'll be able to find those. I'm not. I'm, I refuse to spend any more rupees on this because <laughs> it always seems like I'm wasting rupees. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So, uh, hey, there he is. Go oh, link this way, brother. Hey, so that's what going. You said, hey, I told you not to do that. So that's what going on was all this time. Don't go on was all this time. No, not really. Monsters grabbed me and threw it here in here. Please, brother, please help me get out. No. You're just too mean. You didn't. You didn't f believe in me as being a new Goron brother. No, I don't. No, I'm not. I'm not taking that. No. Help me get out of here, brother. No, not gonna happen. No, I don't have to. There's. There's nothing that says that I have to. Oh, okay. He's just gonna repeat himself. So fine. I'll. I'll let you out. I, I've caved. That's <laughs> what so, we actually do need is help. We're just glad you're okay. Hang on. We'll get you help. Hey, wait. Behind you, Link. Oh no. Oh no, indeed! This is a really tough guy here, and look at look at this. He, ah, yeah, he actually blocks your attacks. This is Hinox, and we got to shoot his eye to stun him, and that's pretty much all we got to do to make him vulnerable. But he takes a ton of hits, and uh, if you keep slashing at him uh, before, uh, you, like just randomly keep slashing at him, thinking that you'll be able to get him all down in one hit, not gonna happen. <laughs> I should say one run. You actually got to do that twice because he, he has so much health that he'll recover before uh, the effects of your arrow will wear off. So you've got to stop for a bit, otherwise they'll knock you away and you'll take damage. Anyway, amazing brother! You actually defeated the monster I, I, I caught. What? <laughs> Thank you, brother. Now I can run freely again. You're welcome, but it seems like we've hit a dead end on our side. See these spikes? They're in our way. That will be no problem. With my assistance, I can help you remove that trap. Now let me show you how to switch between me and Gorolink. When you want to call me, just tap my icon on the lower screen. When you want to switch to Gorolink, tap the icon. Understand how this? No, that's that's really complicated. When you want to call me, tap my icon on the lower screen. When I switch to Gorolink, tap the icon. No, that's still really complicated. Okay, you're just gonna repeat yourself. I just wanted to see. Yeah, I got it. I got it. <laughs> if one of us falls, so will the other. So yeah, they it shares health basically. Now then, leave this next part to me. Switch control of you to me. Uh, so yeah, we switch, and now um, when you tap stuff, he will jump at it. Thusly, and there we go. That is the key to victory. And they'd beware of uh, rock choo choos. Oh, shoot, hanging around these parts. Yeah, you gotta actually jump at them to get them out of your way. Otherwise, you just kind of bounce off them. Because, uh, yeah, if you try to run, roll into them, yeah, see what happens? You gotta actually do a jump attack at them. So the game is actually leaving you to figure out the controls all on your own, because it does not explicitly state how to do this stuff. You've gotta figure it out all on your little self. Or, you know, watch my walkthrough. <laughs> and that opens up. So now we can switch between Link. I'm gonna leave him over there. Now we can make progress on this side. I've seen that like like. I fear the like like because it will eat my shield. Well, it, it can eat my shield if I get sucked into it. And uh, oh no, you don't. Oh no, you don't. Oh no, you don't. <laughs> and that opens that up. Now um, I'm gonna go up here. This is where one of the chests are. And so I'm gonna thus switch over to here and hit the switch. Oh, right, you have to sit, uh, sit on both of them at the same time. I forgot about that. Uh, wait a second, what do you have to say? Uh, born, there are times in life when one should seek the help of others. Thus, when standing alone fails to help, stand together. And I think he's hinting at standing together on these switches. <laughs> Alright, so opening up this chest will give us the dungeon item! Bomb shoes! Well... I guess you could say it's a bomb chew bag, because, you know, we couldn't buy bomb chews at the shop, even though they were there, because we didn't have a bomb chew bag, so technically we got a bag full of bomb chews. They'll follow the path that you draw on your map. Hey, indeed, what? Bomb chews are bombs that run along the path you draw. You can navigate a path on a bomb chew by drawing on the lower screen. They're amazingly handy. Go ahead, try and all to get the hang of it. I already know how to use them, so I'm not, because they're... they're 
you can waste them pretty easily, so I'm not. <laughs> so anyway, I'm going to switch back to you, and uh, yes, he still slinks in the quicksand, so yeah. Um, here we got some eye slugs. They, they're a lot like ropes, in all honesty. You know, they kind of home in on you in a way, and yeah. <laughs> Anyway, they're not really that big of a deal or anything like that. You just hit them and no, you cannot go in that hole But he will actually go in that hole on his own But I mean you can't actually go in that hole on your own here But once you kill off all the critters that door will open and link in advance on that side and uh, yeah, That's pretty much it here for Gangoran. So I'm gonna go loop around here and uh, head on through the gates, which will give us a little cutscene once we get to a certain point. Uh, you'll see here. Uh, once we're able to use our bomb shoes, killing off those critters, we get the last chest of the floor. Remember there was one here, that was one here, that means we got two, which means we did not need to pay 20 rupees of that dang swindler... Grr, gossip stone, grr, freaking... Anyway, now that we opened up that gate, we can draw ourselves... Oh shoot! I misdrew. We gotta draw ourselves a path through the tunnel with the bomb chew. And this is how to take more shortcuts in the Temple of the Ocean King. Watch us. Woo hoo hoo! I got a goat! <laughs> and that opens up that spike wall there. You made it through the spike. You made the spikes go down. You can finally pass through. Are you doing well? <clears throat> Do well away over there, brother Goro Link. I found the hole that I could squeeze through, brother, and if you didn't notice, that hole looked like it was paper thin and just stuck to the wall, but whatever, whatever. <laughs> I will go explore and see if we could, if I can find us a way out. We must split up a bit. See you later, brother! No, wait, don't! Wait, go on. Don't go on. Wait! Oh, he's gone. I hope he'll be safe on his own. I guess I'll keep searching then. Maybe we'll find some pure metal in here. Maybe. Maybe. Anyway, bomb refill unlimited, so yeah. Um, I believe, I believe, I believe this up here is just a shortcut back. Uh, oh shoot. Oh shoot. Oh shoot. Oh yes. <laughs> uh, yeah, I think this is just a shortcut, but I will knock this out just for the sake of completion. Yeah, I'm gonna put it right through there. Oh shoot. What the heck is going on with my pointer? Uh, eh, eh. eh. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, I think that's gonna hit the wall. There we go. Uh, come on, pointer. Don't, don't fail me now. There we go. <laughs> I don't know. I was just kind of, kind of acting weird there. All right. I didn't waste the bomb or anything like that. It's just, just the thing of that stalled me out of time. <laughs> all right. So yeah, this leads back to the start. We already got all the chests here. So this is just there for the future. And now we got another floor going off down this way, of which I'm going to start in the next part. So I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you then when I finish this dungeon. Whoa.